Welcome to Tech Brothers with Ahmed. Today we are going to learn how to delete all the files from a folder that is on FTP server by using SSIS package. Now in this video we will learn how to check the files on FTP server if they are on in the folder or not. So this will let you use uh, the interface uh, or Internet Explorer or Mozilla or Chrome and see how does the FTP server look like. Next uh, we will uh, create our SSIS package in that package uh, we will create a variable to hold uh, or save the value for remote path uh, of a folder with wildcard and then uh, finally we'll use uh, the FTP task uh, in SSIS package uh, to delete those files from FTP server now let me show you the very first thing here is uh, our FTP server now let me close this one and uh, you have to use uh, the IP address or FTP name here is the IP address of my FTP server and I can copy and here is the one of the example that you can use ftp.microsoft.com that can be ftp.yourcompany.com and but in my case I'm using the IP address so you open anything what you like Internet Explorer Mozilla or uh, Chrome and just paste your FTP IP address or the FTP server name and then you will be opening here you have to provide the password and uh, username in my case I have saved it so that's why it didn't ask me and then you click uh, on the folder you can see different files you can see subfolders and everything here under the test folder I have all different type of files but my task is uh, every day I want to run a SSIS package that will delete all the files from this folder and uh, maybe upload new files but uh, this task we will only cover how to delete all of them together now we will be creating an SSIS package let's go to the SSDT or bids in my case I'm gonna go to SSDT as I have SSIS 2012 inside the project I will be clicking on SSIS packages then I will say new SSIS package and here I will be using FTP task and we have to make a connection that's the first thing we have to do FTP connection here we will click on new connection and provide the server name now if you guys will be smart like me you are gonna just go here and then copy the path or server name and go here in the SSIS package and paste it and let's see what happened and then you will provide your username and password and if you run the test okay we got the error it is working in Internet Explorer it but what why not it is working in FTP task so it is saying cannot connect or establish a connection to the server name port name or credential may be invalid so there are multiple errors could be possible but there isn't any error in this case as we are using FTP task it does not accept this part so just remove that part backslash here as well and then leave the IP address or the server name itself and then it should work just fine hit ok next we are going to go to the file transfer and see what operation we need to do we need to delete the files so we will see delete local files no we are not deleting uh, the files from the local server we need to delete the files from remote server so hit delete remote files and then it is asking okay is the remote path is a variable in our case we are saying it's false no it's not so I can go here and just uh, drill to the folder which I want to select and then select a file but I don't want to delete one file I want to delete all of the files so I have to use some wildcard asterisk dot asterisk that means I want to delete anything that start with any name and has any extension so that's what mean asterisk dot asterisk but uh, I don't want to use uh, this hard code value here I want to use uh, I'm gonna cut this part hit ok go create a variable because our company can change mind anytime or they will say uh, they want to change the criteria and they don't want to change the SSIS package 
so we want to create a package with the dynamic uh, value changes we want to create a variable and we can use that variable in the configuration and we can change the value or criteria anytime we can change even the folder path or the file files filter by using the wild cards and the way we want to select the files so let's create this one we call it remote folder path with wildcard and this is the variable and this is what we will use go and it is string provide the value here now asterisk dot asterisk mean delete every file from test folder but what I want to do here I want to come here in the file transfer is the remote path variable true yes it is now I want to use the variable hit ok I'm gonna do some testing here first of all I want to delete only the files which are having extension dot trc so let's do one thing at a time and then we will do all uh, do delete all of them at the end now if I go to the variable I'm gonna do it here just I'm gonna say trc so asterisk means everything dot trc which file has the extension dot trace we will be deleting only that file so or files so start uh, start the package it completed successfully let's go back to the FTP and refresh We might have to refresh a couple of times it is asking me a password I'm gonna provide that now we do not see that that trace file anymore that file is deleted next part uh, what I want to do I want to delete uh, all the .txt file or maybe I want to delete client file anything that starts with the client and then end with the txt that has extension txt I can change my filter so I'm gonna go here I'm gonna say client client c l i e n t asterisk dot txt so anything that starts with client and then we put asterisk after that that it means anything after the client then we have dot and we have put dot txt so anything but only has extension text txt text file right so let's uh, run this one it deleted some files close it and now we go back refresh so it deleted all those files which were starting with the client and they were uh, having extension dot txt this time uh, we have dot dtsx we have text files we have xlx file so there are different type of extensions uh, for these files now what we want to do in this case uh, the final demo we want to drop everything that's what the title was so delete everything so asterisk dot asterisk but uh, as a bonus uh, I showed you few of the things uh, like how to use the wildcard in deleting as well and filter the files you want to delete so we learned some something extra in this one now start button package is done stop it go back to the FTP and refresh and we see that there is no file left in the test folder anymore so that's how you will be deleting the one file or multiple files or all the files from the folder on FTP server thanks very much for watching this video and I will see you in next video